start to wear here and there. I'm Lashana and I'm here to give you what you want. Yeah, yeah. Style, hair, fashion, and flair. Come along, sit down, grab your pretty drink. Stay with me. And for this video, Hey everybody, welcome or welcome back to What to Wear Here and There. Ah, get ready with me as I prepare to go to an amazing event. Y'all know I'm up in here ironing. Stay tuned. This green drink is so good. This is the Bloom, I think. I learned about this um, from Pretty Brie in UA on her YouTube channel. And this really does help with bloating. Like if it's that time of the month, ladies, or if you've um, eaten something that does not agree and you're, you know, holding on to it or whatever. <laughs> not trying to be funny, but yeah. This is good. I keep showing y'all the tasty. I love this because y'all know I love gold, but this drink is so good. This one, let me sh let me get the container and I'll show you. Hold on one second. Just a minute. Hold, please. <laughs> um, this is what it is. It is the boom. Uh, greens and superfoods, orange passion fruit. That's what I was looking for. Y'all know I can't see without my reading glasses. <laughs> it has lots of good, good, good goodies in it. And let me see if I can really, yeah, I'm not, but you guys can see. And I'll put a link below. Um, you'll be able to pick this up from my Amazon marketplace. Uh, if they're still selling it, I'm sure they are, but it's really good. I enjoy it. Um, it doesn't taste gritty or anything. And you can see some of it. I didn't start up that well because I'm in a rush because as you guys can see here, I'm getting ready to go to a brunch, a women's empowerment brunch. Yeah. So let's go. Yes. My double good is here. Woo. Everybody is getting this type of fundraiser from all the kiddos, but I'm trying to support my daughter and the band. All right. Not sure why it's not focusing, but using the Urban Skin RX. Clean towel. Okay guys, so I have washed and cleansed and brushed and all that good stuff. I am going to apply my Yerba Mate, Yerba Mate, under eyes. And I'm gonna kind of rush through. So I'll probably come back once I am done. Um, because I've gotten now down to the point where I am running late, <laughs> as always. Not really always, but a lot of times. <clears throat> so we, my best friend and I are headed to an empowerment, women's empowerment brunch. I found this as I was looking for DMV influencer things to do or just things to do for ladies. And I knew that I would be doing some things with my DMV divas and the influencers and DMV, but I wanted to do something special with my best friend. Um, 
as you guys have seen, she and I go and we do coffee breaks, coffee dates all the time. But I thought this would be really cool, really nice for us to share some and spend some time together as girls and listening to people who would pour into us. So um, I am about to put some oil in my hair. We're gonna use my, and I'll put the oils up on the screen that are in here that I have compiled. Um, a few ladies asked me what was in it and thank you ladies for pointing it out that I did not share. I was just, you know, I just be in here trying to just give it to y'all. So actually I'm just gonna put some out. So it won't be too much. I don't want to be weighed down, but I do. I think I want to wear like a sleek, slick back pony. So we're about to just oil this a little bit and let it sit. Take this out. But yeah, we're going to a women, women's empowerment brunch. And I have two years. And I just think that'll be really fun for us to do something different. And it looks like they're gonna have some good food there. I'll put um, a photo up of what the link shared. I could really just wear it like this. So maybe I should have left my braid up until I get ready to leave. It is time to wash it, so that's why I had left it. But I think I'm gonna add, no, I'm not. I'm gonna I'm put some in my tap, 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 as we do, and just add it to the scalp. And I love, you guys know, I love adding nourishment to my scalp, but I don't like to overdo it, so it won't be weighed down. So, my daughter's leaving. Okay, I had to run off real quick because my daughter was leaving out and I always like to watch her out the door. I've always done that. Um, so right now I am about to get dressed, drinking my green drink. And I already applied the, the, the yerba mate. So we're gonna go ahead with our discoloration correcting serum. This week I experienced some breakouts. Um, I'm not sure what they were from, but my face had a really bad reaction to something y'all. And I mean, you know, it's not the time of the month, so you know, we don't have to go there, but that's usually when you kind of experience those hormonal breakouts. So I don't know. Anyway, my skin have been doing so good for so long. So I don't want to jinx it or, you know, not literally. I don't, I don't believe in jinxing, but anyway, I just want it to be, hey. <laughs> All right, so we have that. And then I like to, this is my little station over here with all of my products. I don't know if you guys can see it. I really don't like for it to be shown. It's not junky, but you know, I just want a more cleaner palette. And I don't know, I haven't created my beauty room yet where I would have all this. My daughter has two rooms. She has her bedroom and she has what used to be like a playroom or a hangout room. And that's kind of what I wanted to do and to be able to sit down and do all of this. That's gonna take some time. I don't want her to feel like we're pushing her out, but she was home all summer y'all and only went in there to get clothes out of her second closet. So that lets me know 
She doesn't need it. When I do this, I realize like I feel like my jawline and, and my chin is like a little offset. It's weird. Nothing happened to me as a child. Like I didn't fall off a bike or do anything, but it's offset. All right, so we're gonna get started. And get ready. I'm not gonna film this whole thing, but I do wanna say that this Anastasia, Anastasia. Um, Beverly Hills like eyebrow gel I love it so much it really keeps my eyebrow hairs intact and I just put some on my finger and then tap it up push it up sometimes I use a brush to kind of see the difference between this one oh poke my eye this one and this one <laughs> it's just standing up so yeah So I don't want to be late to meet Melvina, so I'm going to sign off now and get ready. And you guys will probably see like a little insert of me getting dressed or something like that. And then we shall return <laughs> at a later time. So see you guys in a bit. Get ready with me to go to a women's empowerment brunch. I'm going with my best friend. And so we are just planning on having a good old time. So I've already applied my Anastasia, the Anastasia eyebrow gel. Gonna use my Black Radiance concealer under the eyes. Adding a little bit more because I've had some breakouts this week. Not sure why, but I have. I know everything is backwards, guys, because I have it turned to me, but I'll put the names up on the screen. Okay, I'm back. I got cut off a minute ago. Um, so applying the powder and then... Ooh, let me get that my hair a little bit i think i'm gonna do just a slip back pony because my hair is dirty there's flakes but i think that's from this new product i have and i was gonna share it with you guys later but this is the taraji p henson smooth attitude um a mending and hydrating hair milk and I've been using this this week, but I noticed it kind of gives me, I think, a little bit of a flake um, with the product because I've been using it right here around my hairline. But I love how it smooths it down and it keeps it straight. It doesn't make it curl up. So, yeah, I'm just trying to remove that product. We've all done that, ladies, haven't we? Actually, since I'm just... I seem like I'm all over the place right now. While that's setting in, I'm gonna apply it actually and let you guys see, it pushes up like that and it squirts out 
here. And the consistency is just like any other type of thick um, hair cream, lotion. And as you see here, it's really very, very smoothing. I, it smells good, it has a nice fragrance. So this is sort of what I've been using in place of my Senora Rizada because I still haven't purchased any. I've been saying it on every video, right? But I only use a dollop, but I just like full bottles of everything. Full bottles of everything, y'all. So, <clears throat> um, and but most of the time I don't, well, I do use my Senora Rizada to pull back um, my buns or my pony sometimes. Um, but if you can see how she's working for me, I love it. But the dry and the dry down doesn't give a white cast or flake. But when you're trying to brush it out, I think I noticed that, um, like just now, but there could be a few little flakes in there because it is time to wash my hair so anywho we're pulling this back in a high pony and if we could grab a ponytail holder y'all I'm a little disorganized this morning because I'm, oh there it is over there I'm running late. My out for the first two outfits I actually had prepared. Just didn't. Uh oh, I have hair out. Shoot. Um, the first two outfits that I picked did not come together for me. So I feel like. I need to be recording this on a full length screen. So hold please. Hey everybody. So I'm just pulling my hair back in this sleek bun, piggybacking off of that other video that I was creating for, um, I guess, TikTok. And I just figured I better go ahead and finish it out here um because this is what how i started oh wow that hurt so y'all my setup is just not the best i don't know i kind of deconstructed my whole tripod and the lighting and everything um back like before i um got sick like over a week ago just to kind of like reconfigure and I didn't and now I feel the need to film and so now it's not all the little like portions and specifications that I had are not lining up so you guys are even set up on a different little holder or whatever it's called so okay so with this um hair i need to do some edges so i'm gonna pull in my senora risada here i'm rushing now it's only like a half an hour where i'm going but i don't want to feel rushed when i'm walking in to meet malvina and I want us to be able to get good seats and I don't want it to be because of me that we don't have good seats. So I'll probably end this in a few minutes so I can continue getting ready without stopping and talking to you guys because y'all slow me down. You know, I'll be trying to, you know, get all the info and the details and just the chit chat. Um, I am feeling much better. Thank you to those. Thank you all who have been praying for me and sending me beautiful messages and all sorts of things. 
Um, really appreciate y'all. Um, I just really highly encourage everyone to get your annual physical as they become due because my annual physical revealed that my hemoglobin was, I don't even say super duper low, it was critically low. That's what the doctor said. And they called me after hours to say, hurry and get to the emergency room and get a blood transfusion ASAP. Like no questions asked, like hurry. Don't even drive because and they literally said I could lose conscious at, consciousness at any moment and expire. When you hear those words, they don't make you feel good, you know. And so I'm just encouraging everyone to listen to your body. I had been tired. Yes, checked off all the boxes for, you know, the symptoms. Tired, shortness of breath. And you guys notice, or I don't know, some people told me they've noticed on my videos where I sound out of breath when I'm talking. My husband says it's just because I try to get all my words out like in one breath he's like breathe you know but anyway i do thank god that he kept me here and that i had been working out maybe i feel like that had helped me to sustain at least a little while i was going through um but i'm just thankful grateful and blessed i always say um to know that you know God was still with me and he's never left me. <laughs> I don't know, I, I pray for those who aren't in relationship um, with our father, the creator, but um, whether you believe or not, whatever you believe in, I'm just grateful and thankful that I'm still here and for those who are sitting down and waiting, go. Go and get yourself checked out. Getting your blood labs done that, you know, tells a story about what's going on with your body. And so if you don't have the story to be told, you, don't, you know, there might be a bad ending. I don't know. And that's what the doctor said. The outcome won't be good for you if you don't go. And I was like, what? Jesus, That's, that really put me in shock. It didn't make me afraid or scared. Like, and honestly, like I did share with some family that in going into the appointment, I felt like I was gonna get some news that was not favorable. I felt like that that morning when I woke up. So I kind of had prepared myself, but I thought it was like news, like all oh, your cholesterol is high, you know, you have too much sodium. In your system, you know, because I eat popcorn, like it's going out of style. So I was just waiting for that bad news, you know, not the bad news of my blood is critically low and, you know, I could die, basically. So anyway, I am thankful to God, thankful to you all, and... I want you guys to go get yourselves checked out. Get yourselves checked out so you'll be all right, okay? <laughs> all right, so moving on. Um, trying to get this twirl curl, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. I wanna use some of this Taraji milk on my twirl curl and see how that does, how that holds it down. Cause I just, you know, I wanna support um, those black owned businesses. I hope this is black owned. I hope she's not just, you know, the namesake for, you know, a random company. <laughs> but, you know, it's possible. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time with this little side. I don't like for it to look like the fake like when people wear wigs and nothing against it, of course, my daughter has worn wigs. I don't want it to look like the wig where they pulled out the edges. Like, you know, I want it to look like my natural edge. So I think I'm done with that. So I need to put my scarf on. I'm gonna put on my eyebrows, finish up my makeup, and then I'll be back. 
Okay, here's the fun part. It's time to get dressed. So I am just sharing the earrings. First of all, those are Koi. Pick those up at Shop Koi. And then those are my Vince Camuto Golden Heels, my Golden Clutch. And that bag is so roomy, it's so soft, it's just so good, I love it. Removing my earrings there, and I'm doing a little dance, about to put on those Koi Post earrings. They are oversized sphere or ball earrings. Y'all who know me in real life know that I love a good stud, and I even better love a good ball earring or sphere earring. I fell in love with the big giant gold balls back in New York City in Brooklyn where my cousins were rocking those back in the day and I have never left the, the love for those earrings have never departed so here we are we're about to put on that Target jumper that I got that I shared um in a few videos a few videos past I'm getting undone y'all are not gonna see my unmentionable so don't even start scoffing at me y'all but we are putting on that jumper it's so much fun it flowed I love the way it fit it covered me all the way except for the shoulders so all right don't come for me all y'all evangelists and missionaries out there mommy thank you very much <laughs> we are getting you know zipped up scooted all up in there y'all and then, oh, let's see what's next. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're gonna put on the baubles. I love that bracelet. Yes, I forget that I have it all the time. And then here we go. We're trying to switch out the necklaces, my favorites that I wear all the time that I never take off. I kind of started peeling those off, put on that beautiful vintage Givenchy necklace. And then I put on, you know, my Alhambra, I love that so much. Oh, it's like my absolute favorite from Van Cleef and Arpels. Um, I love layering my necklaces, but I just added to then that Valaya by Parfums de Marley and then the Lueve um, fragrance. I layered those. They smell divine together, y'all. Divine, yes. Has. It's a little bit more, you know, it's okay. And then I'm adding my additional earring up there at the top and then my rings, the usual suspects. And then we're almost done, y'all. Gonna show again what I'm wearing on my feet and under my arm. I love that 24 karat gold color. Oh my gosh, it's just amazing. Gotta keep those girls up, y'all. <laughs> okay, so we're ready to go. Bye for now and on to the next. Okay guys, I'm ready. I'm trying to run out the door. I'm late, but it's gonna be okay. We have to be the first people there. But I'm about to take my iron and my uh, my allergy pills, cause you know, and I'm gonna finish off this bloom. Y'all get y'all some, it helps with the bloat, cause okay. Especially when you wear, you know, outfits like this, you're drinking pretty drinks. It's not so pretty, but it's pretty in the, you know, the container is pretty. Anyway, we're gonna head out to this event and I will take y'all with me, try to film as much as I can. And this is my look and I'm gonna be wearing these heels in this bag. And I hope, you know, it just does what it's supposed to do. All right, so I will check y'all later. Bye for now. Hey everybody, I am driving. I'm on the way to the event. I will see you guys there. Like we're gonna be, um, yeah, we look like we got that. Thank you. I just wanted to kind of do the little okay, but I'll have to show you know where I am. Um, yeah. let me get this. this space. You don't want to be rushed, yeah. So I was oh, like, no, nah, let's just do that later. And um, so I was like, oh, this is nice. At least we got some air, right? And then... Hey, um... That's nice. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Hey, everybody. Welcome or welcome back to What to Wear Here and There. I'm your gracious host, Lashana. Welcome, welcome, welcome! We're at an event, y'all. I'm here with my best friend. And this is... 
part of the vlog where it's gonna be shared, probably if I can, like the panelists and all the little good stuff that's going on here at the Women's Empowerment. Um, this is a brunch. Yeah, yes. Brunch. So anyway, I, Melvin is holding my camera for me. So we gotta get together and I'm gonna show y'all. She looks so beautiful. Shadow, y'all. Close your eyes real quick. Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> y'all know I'm silly. <laughs> She's so pretty. So I'm about. We well, I'm about to go over here and check out what is at the little like pop up. The vendors. The vendors. See, that's why she's here to help me. The vendors, and then whatever else we got. All right. Bye for See now. You. It's so pretty in here. I like this space and it's called the space. Back. 
Okay, I'm gonna take this, but I want to yes, throw it here too. If you are in the DMV, come by, guys. I'm loving these pieces. Let's go. And this is pretty too. Look at this dress. Oh, I love that. What are the size options? Um, so this, this from a medium to like a 2X. Okay. Isn't that fun? Ooh, that's vacation, that's brunch, that's all. Thank you. I'm going to come back and look at that shirt. Okay. I want to keep going. Keep going. Hello. Filming a little bit for my vlog. This is awesome. Oh, nice. nice. What is your name? Tonda. I'm with TC's Cozy Corner Boutique. Oh, nice. And where's that located? Um, we're based out of um, La Plata, Maryland. Oh, cool. Good and local. Okay. So we have Christian based t shirts. Mm -hmm. The t shirts are.
weekly sample of our solid lotion bars. Its base is organic mango butter with like coconut oil and vitamin E oil. And just natural. They all smell all natural. natural. And and so this is take it and your so, lotion. Lotion. so you have to so use the one because it got it, I drove up this. So I use it as my um I use it as my sample. Just so you can see. So like when you get out the shower and bath, you literally just like rub it on like this. Okay. You, you, you get milk with your body temperature, so you're only going to use what your body needs, and then you get it back on your nightstand, on your on your uh, bathroom yeah. counter, wherever. Um, and so that's what it will look like. I see. That's pretty. <laughs> Thank you. I like that one. How much are they? They are um, here. They are two for twenty-five or one for fifteen on the website. They are one for fifteen. Um, so if you get them while you're here, it's you do the one over here have a cost saving. But we are running a promotion right now: free shipping over thirty dollars on the website uh, for the rest of the weekend. Okay. I'm gonna get my best friend to come over too. I'll be having one for her and one for me. I want you to wash your hands. I want you to try it. It's really going to make your skin feel like super silky, but not greasy. Okay. You want to feel greasy. I can rub some more in your feel like you feel like it's just soft. And it's all natural. Nice. Mango butter, coconut oil, and oil. That's great. Okay, well, I'll be back. Thank you for stopping by. Come back after you finish. I'll be watching it. Okay. Thank you, Cam. No problem. all right Ooh, they gave me a mouthful of information you have to go over there and try the um there's a hand there's a lady who's
go to Starbucks so I'm just gonna wait am I gonna get a Panera coffee the line is crazy okay guys so we were just at an empowerment brunch to uplift women I was there with a celebrity makeup and hairstylist from the area who worked on Love and Hip Hop, Married to Madison, Real Housewives. Her name is Nima Ali. She's awesome. She shouted out my bestie. Malvina was like, I know her, I think. Come to find out the girl was all over Malvina. So that was so, the lady was all over Malvina about her cakes because Malvina bakes, right? I just thought that was so nice for some event that she didn't even know that she was going to know anyone for them to pump her up. They brought her up front to celebrate great grandmas because Malvina is a grandmother, believe it or not. And it was just really fun. It was very inspirational, very positive and loving. The environment was awesome and the food was, <laughs> I keep saying amazing and awesome, but the food was great. So we had a really good time. So I'm going to insert a lot of some of the video and pictures and just a blast i'm so glad my best friend and i were able to go out and do something together that was more than just our regular coffee because that's what we do and i don't take it for granted i love our coffee moments but doing something kind of nice out where we get dressed up and get pretty and do our hair and makeup and sit among other ladies with the same mindset that's fun and i'm glad we're able to do it so i'm gonna try to get this coffee I, this line is not moving y'all i'm about to go find some coffee somewhere else all right Peace out. Until the next time. <laughs> 